Danville police are taking action tonight after a second shooting in a week. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm John Carlin and I'm Brittany McGraw. Lindsay is on assignment. An 18 year old girl is recovering after an early morning shooting at Sheets gas station. This happened across the street from Buffalo Wild Wings, which was the scene of a shootout almost exactly a week ago. 10 News reporter Coulter Anstat joins us live now and Coulter, a lot of people want to know what happened. Yeah, of course, that is the all important question. And right now, police are still trying to really figure that out. As you mentioned, they do know that an 18 year old woman was grazed by a bullet in what police are describing as a busy parking lot here at the Sheets gas station early this morning. That is why possibly beginning as early as tonight, you could notice an increased police presence around the gas station. It is just a couple of steps away from the parking lot of the Buffalo Wild Wings, where two people were shot at almost the exact same time last Thursday morning. Police are also considering talking to some of the businesses here in the area. At 1246 this morning, Danville police responded to the Sheets gas station on Riverside Drive for a reported shooting. The call came in almost one week to the minute after two people were shot across the street at Buffalo Wild Wings. Now, Danville police want the public to know that these shootings will not go unanswered by the department. Typically, we don't talk about specifics, but there will be an increase in police presence. Uh, we'll probably be working with the business owners there. Um, about scheduling and um, all kinds of stuff. Tracy Motley works at custom embroidery and screen printing in the Riverview Plaza behind sheets and across the street from Buffalo Wild Wings. The two shootings don't bother her. We stay to ourselves. We mind our business over here. Motley welcomes the increased police presence, though. I think they should be over there more um, with people going back and forth to work early in the morning or getting off from work at night. I think it should be more police over there at Sheets. Last week, businesses I spoke to off camera in the plaza shared similar opinions. They said the gun violence doesn't bother them, especially since it happens when their businesses are closed. But Sheets customer Jimmy Adams says the gun violence is concerning, and he too is glad to hear about the increased police presence. I think it's a good idea until they can figure out what's going on with the situation. No arrests have been made for this morning's shooting. Four people have been charged for for last week's shooting at Buffalo Wild Wings, two have been arrested. The 18 year old woman who was grazed by the bullet in this morning shooting was treated at and released from the hospital here in Danville. Police say they found multiple shell casings from multiple calibers of guns in the parking lot of the sheets. If you have any information, contact the Danville Police Department. Live in Danville, Coulter Anstat, 10 News, working for you.